वेलकम टू 1.1 प्रपोजिशन सो दी वेरी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज अ प्रपोजिशन इट इज अ डिक्लेरेटिव सेंटेंस व्हिच इज आइदर ट्रू और फॉल्स बट कैन नॉट बी बोथ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इट कैन नॉट बी ट्रू एंड फॉल्स फॉर एन एग्जांपल वी हैव वन प्लस वन इज टू सो इट्स अ डिक्लेरेशन प्लस दिस इज ट्रू सेंटेंस देर फोर वी कैन से इट एज प्रपोजिशन और यू मे से इट एज स्टेटमेंट प्रपोजिशन स्टेटमेंट सिनोनिम्स ओके नाउ सी एग्जाम्पल टू दैट इज वेरी क्रिटिकल वन प्लस वन इज लेवन योर माइंड इज लाइक दिस इज फॉल्स सो नॉट अ प्रपोजिशन रॉन्ग इट इज अ प्रपोजिशन वाई बिकॉज वन प्लस वन इज लेवन इज अ डिक्लेरेशन प्लस इट इज फॉल्स सेंटेंस सो डिक्लेरेटिव सेंटेंस एंड आइदर ट्रू और फॉल्स इफ टू क्राइटेरियाज आर सेटिस्फाइड देन इट इज अ प्रपोजिशन देर फोर दिस इज डिक्लेरेटिव प्लस फॉल्स अ प्रपोजिशन Similarly, example three: Mumbai is in Gujarat. A false sentence plus a declaration, so proposition. Fourth example: six is greater than three. Yes, it's a declaration and a true sentence, so proposition. Example five is very critical. We shall have biryani for dinner. Now you might be thinking, oh, Sarji, this is not proposition. It is a proposition. You have to wait for dinner time to verify whether we got biryani or we have not gotten the biryani. If we got the biryani, then true sentence. If not, then false. Right? But true and false will not come. Therefore, declarative sentence plus true or false. Therefore, a proposition. Then, sir, is there any sentence which is not a proposition? Definitely, questions, exclamation, variable, and commands are not propositions. For an example, do you speak Tamil? It's a question. not a proposition right now look at second example what a hot day it's an exclamation therefore not a proposition now example 3 might be critical because you might be thinking sir this is a proposition because x plus 1 is 7 is a declaration and if we solve it x is equal to 6 is the answer so it should be a proposition no it is not a proposition why let us investigate suppose x plus 1 is 7 If I substitute x is equal to six, then the above statement is true. If I substitute x is equal to five, then five plus one is six. Six is not equal to seven. Then it is false. So the given sentence is becoming true and false depending on the x. Therefore, true and false not allowed. Either true or false. Therefore, not a proposition. Understood? Then we have the commands. Close the door. true or false there is no discussion at all therefore not a proposition understood so now let us go to the next slide we have proposition variables what we are going to do here convert english into maths how to do it let us see by an example see what we have here 1 plus 1 is 2 sir we have maths already no this is not maths this is a proposition this is a statement because a declaration and true sentence right therefore this is a proposition we are going to assign this proposition to a variable p this variable p is known as proposition variable okay now you told me that sir 1 plus 1 is 2 it's a true sentence therefore as per the maths logic p can be said as true which is t or you might replace with with 1 okay this means the above proposition is a true sentence If P is one, this means true sentence. If P is T, means true sentence. Therefore, you should make a note as per the truth table value. Truth table value. If we have true proposition, then true is represented by T or one. If we have a false sentence, then it is F or represented by zero. See example two. Mumbai is in Gujarat. Let me assign Q variable to it. So Q variable is what? Mumbai is in Gujarat. So this Q is nothing but now proposition variable. It can be anything R S T any variable you can take. And here the nature of Q is what? The nature of Q is F because it is false. Mumbai is not in Gujarat, right? Or you may say it as zero. Understood? What is proposition variable? So this is all about one point one. what is a proposition or a sentence examples on it what is not a proposition and then assigning variables to statement which is known as proposition variable thank you for watching this 1.1